Most Americans believe that the United States adheres to the gold standard of food. But can you believe that there are American foods that other countries have banned? Hello to the good audience of Brands Decoded Channel. If we want to have a general look at today's main issue from the unsanitary measures that are carried out in the mass production of food to even the preservatives and chemicals that are used for the durability, attractiveness of the color and taste of the product, it causes the non-importation of some food to most countries. The world has become. Let's see how much the world is really wrong about this issue. Number 1. Ever since the dawn of Skittles, there have been rumors about the dangers of eating them, with each of us having at least one classmate claiming that the red ones will make you sterile, and yellow colors that give you cancer. Of course, it could be worse. And your classmates are not wrong some yellow 5 yellow 6 food dyes are associated with urticaria and hyperactivity in children. Sweden and Norway have banned the consumption of candy. Skittles is likely to be banned by the end of the year due to concerns that the European Union has already replaced some of the coloring with more natural flavors due to something called titanium dioxide, which can be found and makes colors appear throughout the rainbow research. Titanium dioxide linked to damaged DNA that can lead to cancer, while Europe may be ahead of the Skittles awareness curve. The US is quickly overshooting in May 2021. The Environmental Working Group urged the FDA to classify titanium as toxic and yes, before you ask. Right now, the FDA says it's okay to consume some of that chemical compound. You can taste the rainbow, but only in moderation. California is home to an ongoing lawsuit against Farda Inc. Is so maybe play it safe for now. Just go eat some Swedish fish instead you've never laid eyes on. A piece of French baguette, either in cartoons or in real life. But let's be honest, it's probably been in Pepe Le Pio's hands, and I think I can. Make sandwiches as we talk about the invention of sliced bread. Many European countries have actually banned many of the things you find on American. Supermarket shelves, because we make many of our breads. We make it not only with it. Cereals, but with a variety of snack packs with valuable additives such as azotocarbonamide, which helps whiten mud and strengthen dough. Interesting fact about azotocarbonamide is also in a range of industrial products, including yoga mats to downward dogs used. The European Union is really against the idea of its own citizens. Eating yoga mat materials and using them in food products is prohibited. Pork, another white meat, is a staple of American meats, along with fish, chicken, and beef. From bacon to ham hot dogs to pulled pork, per capita, every year my heart stops. Don't get us wrong, other countries indulge in pork just as much, if not more, than Americans. So why doesn't the US export the juicy hog bacon points as well slow? It is known that the U.S. adds, many chemicals are used during the processing of ractopam and in many pig farms to raise piglets. China and Russia have received less ractopam since 2013, following a worldwide pork export ban. Since the European Union outlawed ractopam in 2009, perhaps this is because ractopam has similar effects to a human poison and can cause headaches tachycardia, and muscle spasms when consumed in small amounts. But the small price to pay for a whole piece of pork in America is often observed, becomes using chemicals in the chlorine bath and calling it FDA approved and chicken is no exception to this rule. Pathogenicity reduction treatments, or farts, refer to the use of various chemicals to kill harmful microbes on raw meat somewhere along the line. The best way to kill salmonella and other bacteria in uncooked poultry is chlorine. Marinade and it doesn't seem like the EU is against public swimming pools right now. And then the risks from chlorine consumption are actually relatively low. The bigger concern it's that chlorine baths are just an ice or band-aid for the larger problem of beak tip. So they worry that these baths aren't enough to deal with common bacteria and don't reach a potential 
contamination from things like low-quality feed into unsanitary cages on farms where the EU calls chlorine washing an easy method, arguing that no chemical wash will ever remove all the bacteria from heavily contaminated meat as a result of poor hygiene. French Mountain Dew deals more damage. It's the closest thing to completely weaponized soda ever. But did you know that soda is completely banned in Austria and Norway? That's because Mountain Dew's signature Chernobyl radiant color comes from tartrazine, also known as Yellow 5. And if your ADHD hasn't started yet, however, you'll recall that the color number N from the Skittles section used to be associated with headaches hyperactivity and a desire to be annoying to other people, ironically the very qualities that make Mountain Dew a soda in other countries, is what this brand advertises. Do a crazy over-caffeinated lifestyle, do Baja Blast, and while you might be able to find Mountain Dew in Europe, it's a little different because Europe spent exactly two years riding the 90s. Do past and then? Stopped it being sold as Mountain, you do has a recipe close to the original soda, created by Tennessee bottlers Barney and Ollie Hartman in the 1940s. Like the old commercials used to read lies here, you'll be tickled. Oh, Little Dew by Mountain View has been providing Americans with comfort snack food since the 1960s, with their zebra cake variety, but their big claim to fame, as anyone who's ever had their lunch packed by their parents can attest is that little Debbie Swiss rolls are the combination of rich chocolate cake and creamy? Buttercream that over 900 million cartons of little Debbie ships products a year, but none from these cartons they go near Austria or Norway and blame those evil yellow 5 and red 40 additives. The Swiss roll contains 32 milligrams per product and this shows that it is in the colors on children and we are not just talking about creating too much activity. A study showed that removing all artificial food colors did diets may be one of these. It's half as much as children consume and while we can't prove a direct link between artificial food coloring and cancer, it does damage white blood cells, causing them to die in three hours. Get hurt becomes exposure to these colors can cause tumor cells. That's why they say that. Long-term use of food dyes in life is not recommended. If they are not very tasty, it's amazing that you can buy Swiss roulette in the EU. But they come with warning labels. There are companions who advise parents. Thanks to the potential dangers you know for kids like smoking, when you hear the words forbidden breakfast cereal, you probably do one of the countless brands of sweet bites for kids, like the deliciously crunchy cookie. So it's possible be surprised to know this. In fact, Special K is the most boring cereal on Earth, banned in Denmark and banned in the EU, arguably because of its health benefits in the UK. Special K has been criticized by the Advertising Standards Authority for leaking the amount of folic acid it packs in some portions, yet it is still legal to buy in Europe. Denmark has completely banned Special K for everyone since 2004. It's enriched vitamins and minerals. Regulators argue that Kellogg's cereal is unnaturally high in everything from vitamin A to zinc, actually labeling Special K as a genetically modified organism, or GMO, please. Special K is made with the same synthetic ingredients, is, which studies have shown to potentially create health risks especially for children and pregnant women. Finally, you may have to deal with crunch berries. Take an intercontinental flight to visit foods that Americans have banned. Just drive to the Canadian border and flash your passport and sign the affidavit. That being said, you can't get any steak tartar in your trunk for meat consumption in the United States. Much like other foods like veal and pot, it won't make you sick, but it may upset you. But while baby beef and stuffed foie gras are illegal in parts of America, tartar is now nowhere to be seen. While veal and pate may be cool, unlike tartar, where cold meat is shredded, served hot, raw or uncooked can lead to increased food poisoning and parasitic infections, 
especially in beef and poultry. But given how fancy pants steak tartar is a titanic meal, think countries might look the other way and let luxury foods slip away. And for a long time, meat in Canada had to reach an internal temperature of 145 degrees Fahrenheit, equivalent to a medium rare steak, to be considered safe to serve. But there are these rules are not so strictly enforced that as recently as 2021, restaurant owners in New Brunswick selling steak tartar were all served with cease and desist letters. They had a foreign botulism side order. Is there anything more American than Coca-Cola? The taste of the former secret ingredient cocaine. Cocaine is basically apple pie in drink form. Invented. They are not. Cola quickly caught on overseas. It was the drink of choice of World War II before. The pandemic. Always be the exception and unlike the others on the list. For once, it has nothing to do with health concerns. Everyone knows that Coca-Cola is not good for you. We just collectively decided that we don't care which countries outlaw the brand. Have done? Have done this. So because of what? Is a symbol of American capitalist aggression from 1962 to 2011? The United States banned the sale of Burmese coke as part of sanctions against the military junta. That ruled the country until 2011. Its sale was resumed in the country in 2012. Today, Coca-Cola is unavailable in only two countries, with long-standing trade embargoes with the United States. Castro recorded the sources in 1962. First, the antecedents, now Coca-Cola, there's something that doesn't go away with the federalization of the business tax in irony. The beverage of choice, though black market sales are limited, is after all the birthplace of Cuban Libra, aka rum and Coke M and M's delicious melt in your mouth. Not in your hand snacks, originally a collaboration between Sons of the Mars Science and Hershey, is Dynasties in 1941. Like Coca Cola, MM gained an international following during World War II as American. Soldiers popularized the candy overseas as a chocolate that didn't quite make your trigger finger sticky. But in you will not find candy in Sweden due to a trademark conflict with a popular national candy that also has the lowercase m as its signature. It was banned when Mars introduced the candy to Sweden in 2009. A court ruled that its marketing was too similar to the Marabou as a Norwegian that was similar to the Kit Kat during World War I Marabou moved its production to its Swedish neighbors where it received a royal decree from the king of Sweden and here we thought the Swiss with chocolate snobs should check out what the fuss is about Marabus in IKEA stores here is sold you